Hello friends in this video we will cover our second topic of calculations and the topic is body surface area there are very few things you have to remember to solve problem related to body surface area first is its its formula which is bsa is equals to height into weight in divided by 3600 and overall square root always remember in exam that you have to check bsa unit will be in meter square second thing you have to remember is the height whether in question or anywhere but you have to put in centimeter third thing is the weight or uh, weight unit is kilogram so please be sure that you check these three units now because it's a simple uh, topic we will discuss about sample questions which can be asked in exam so we have for example a case scenario like km a new immigrant came to your pharmacy you start preparing his medical profile his weight is 60 kg and height is 168 cm this is the simplest example because units are in same unit in which we need it that is kg and cm so how we going to solve it okay they will ask what is body surface area so apply the formula 168 cm was height multiply by 60 kg was weight and divided by 3600 when you solve the values the answer will be 2.8 now apply square root and when you apply on your calculator the final answer will be 1.673 meter square there is one interesting thing i found this morning when i was making this video this is the calculator you will get in exam so previously there was sharp el something a calculator which were provided during the exam for calculation but now pebc is showing this calculator which will be on your screen that means you will not provided with a physical calculator you have to familiarize yourself with this on screen calculator so uh, in this calculator you will see that there is an under root or square root sound uh, sorry mark and then these are the number buttons so when you solve bsa remember that the square root is there and the second thing you have to check in your calculator is it must be on degree okay so carry on with our uh, this calculator uh, you will find on pebc website uh, they provided with a pdf picture of this so i took it from there now continue with our sample questions if they want to make a question more complicated they can add some more information like um first they will provide height and weight information and they will not say to calculate body surface area but they will say like abc drug concentration is 135 mg per meter square so what you have to do you have to calculate the required dose 
now here I know that those calculation have different formula when we go there we will discuss that but here keep it simple here we will solve it as 135 milligram uh, dose of concentration of the drug multiplied by our body surface area was 1.673 so calculate it with my with me and you will get the answer 22 uh, 225.8 milligram similarly if they want to make it more complicated or they want to consume your time in exam what they will do more in the same question they will change the units so they will not give you values in kilogram or centimeter but they will change unit to anything for example here km new immigrant came to your pharmacy you start preparing his medical profile his weight is 132 pound so now it is not in kilogram and height is 162 cm so first you have to convert this pound into kilogram so here uh, we already discuss in first video that how we will convert it 1 kilogram is equals to 2.2 pound 1 pound is equals to 1 divided by 2.2 kg so 132 pound will be 132 divided by 2.2 kg the answer will be 60 kg so in exam you have to convert it in kilogram first now if they want you to really waste your time they will change uh, more units more complicated units so here one more example similar question km new immigrant came to your pharmacy you start preparing his medical profile his weight is 132 pound and height is 5 feet 6 inches now you want your height in centimeters okay so convert the height first in centimeters and then pound into kilogram and then calculate bsa this is the hardest example you can face in exam uh because you are not mathematician you are a pharmacist they will not go more harder than this solution will be we all know that 1 foot is equals to 12 inches so 5 feet is equals to 5 into 12 is equals to 60 inches so here 5 feet is equals to 60 inches and we have 6 inches more so added total we have 66 inches now we already remember that 1 meter is equals to 39.37 inches so when we convert inches into meter 1 inch will be 1 divided by 39.37 meters and 66 inches is equals to 66 divided by 39.37 meters so how much meters we gain is 1.676 meters now we don't need the answer in meters either we want it in centimeter so we learn that centi is 10 is to power minus or 3 i don't know we have to check no problem but when you have to convert meter into centimeter you multiply the value with 100 so the final answer will be 167.6 cm so these are some examples of questions that you have to do if you practice really well no matter how hard exam will come no problem you know how to tackle the calculations